Hey, Tim Cray here from Expert Power Wash in Portland, Oregon. Hey, I want to show you a quick little project that I'm working on with the Hydro Power uh, Unger uh, DI tank. So let me show you what we got going on here. All right, guys, there's my uh, Father's Day gift, Milwaukee uh, tool cabinet. Very happy with that. But uh, to get back to the video here, what we're dealing with is this uh, Unger Hydro Power uh, DI tank. Uh, so the reason why I got this it's uh, compact it's handy i already have this di tank here but you know with spouts coming out both sides it's just a little bit easier um, i got a big solar panel cleaning job and this would work a lot better for my needs so um, you've probably seen all these parts here uh, it's good to have spare parts you never know when these things are going to break so speaking of this here um, anybody that has any of these uh unger uh, hydro powers these threads in here are regular pipe threads they are not garden hose so let me show you here if you're going to get one of these or you're going to get so this one almost looks like that one if you're going to pick up one of these it's not going to fit so when you go to windowcleaner.com make sure you get the uh the national pipe thread for that or it's not going to fit and then probably Order yourself some extra ones. They're only three dollars a piece. So, Jordy over there was awesome. He helped me out, got me some some orders of that, and then uh, this deal here. Uh, these are less than five bucks, uh, but they are plastic. This one fell off a of one story today, so that deal's broken. So, what I did is I went to Home Depot, picked up some packs of these here quick disconnects got a new one to put back onto here so let me show you the system that I'm running so that goes in there garden hose goes in there and then what I'm doing here is something maybe a little bit differently than something that uh, other people are doing so I'm cleaning some solar panels where I, I'm gonna have to use a lot of hose you know 100 plus feet so what I have here is I have a 3 8 line, and I got this from windowcleaner.com, the whole hose reel and the, the hose, it, it all came together. You can look that up. I'm not sure what I paid for it, but so anyways, um, your water-fed pull line would usually go in here. Let's see if I can do this one-handed. Uh, there it goes. So it's just a regular uh, garden hose fitting on this, this 3 8 and this is actually coarse thread. So all them extra pieces that I have, it will work on that. So make sure you get spare parts. I'm not gonna push that in right now, but you get the point. So that connects into there. So I have a hundred feet of hose here. Like I said, it was three eighths. And so what this does is it keeps the water pressure up without having to use a pump. So you can see the end of the line there. So you can see what I'm doing here. I got one, another one of them quick disconnects. And then the water fed pull line goes right into that. So if I take that out, you can kind of see it's a, a push pin fitting. And then it just goes, the ones you get from windowcleaner.com, they're just standard. If I can put this in with uh, one hand here. There it goes. So we got it all rolled up now. We just got back from a job, but I'm running the X-Zero uh, Pro. I know they're running a couple different models now, but that's the one that I'm running, this carbon fiber. And then I'm really liking this Boar's Hair um, Tucker Alpha Brush. So this is a 12 inch, I got an 18 inch also. So this is what I've been using on the solar panels and it seems to be doing a pretty good job. Um, but I did have to use my other 100 footer when that piece broke that I was telling you about, and I noticed a significant amount of uh, pressure drop as far as uh, pressure to the brush there. So um, something like this will help keep your pressure up. Uh, and this is what I'm using. I am no expert per se, <laughs> expert power wash, but as far as uh, the window cleaning solar panels, um, just getting into this, but this is a system that I'm using and it seems to be working pretty well. So if you guys got any questions, uh, hit me up. I'll help you out as much as I can. Have a great day.